Christina Latonic. Rear Commoner, Joe Zimmerman. Fleet Captain, Jenna Bench. Secretary, Mark Salaga. Treasurer, Vern Hughes. <laughs> Financial Secretary, Tom Sansini. <laughs> Trustee, Andy Greer. Trustee John Boyski, Trustee Carmen Durante, Trustee Jim Baer, <laughs> Trustee Ann Lawrence, Terry Coffin, Mr. 
ready. Pass commenter Dave Fisher. Request permission to come aboard. Commodore Hanson. Permission granted. Thank you. Dance Commodore Fred Swain. Permission to come aboard, sir. Permission granted. Permission granted. Go! At this time, we'd like to acknowledge our visiting club. From Anchor Yacht Club, we have Commodore with his officers. Commodore is Kevin Coyne. Okay, with me today, I have my princess, Hillary Cara. Bridesburg. Club. I would like to thank Bristol Yacht Club for inviting me here today, and I wish you all a happy and safe boating season. On behalf of the uh, members, officers, and directors of the Bridgeburg Albert Club, we also wish the same thing, a happy and safe boating season. Thank you. Okay, from Farragut Sportsman Association, Rick Latonic, Treasurer. I'd like to thank uh, everybody in here on behalf of Farragut. Um, a happy and safe boating season. From the Chamonix Harbor Yacht Club, Paul Richardson. Put a couple more, sir. Mission granted. Hi everyone. Uh, with me today I have our Princess, Ms. Erin Petruska, and also our great Vice Commodore, Ms. Tom Chakowsky. I'm going to give this, I'm going to give Erin uh, the mic right now. I want to thank Bristol Yacht Club for having me here today, and I want to wish everyone a safe and enjoyable boating season. And I would just really like to uh, extend to Bristol from our officers all the uh, gratuity they offer, the gratuities they offer to us, uh, and I really thank Bristol. So, uh, thank you. Okay, from Winston Armenia Club, we have Commodore Jerry K. Well. Our 2012 Princess Erin Pierce. Hello everyone. I would like to thank Bristol for having me here today on this beautiful day and have a happy and safe boating season. Thank you. Also we have Drew Pierce, and the officer of Wissanoming. And on behalf of Wissanoming, we wish you guys, everybody, a good, happy, safe party season. I also need to recognize Charlie Heil is here as a past Commodore of Wissanoma. Thank you. At this time, we're sorry. Unfortunately, our princess could not make it. She's in Las Vegas enjoying her 21st. So at this time, we have our future princess. Please come up. At this time, we are going to honor uh, deceased members of the club.
I'd like to wish the best of luck to the princesses, and I'm sure I can speak from other clubs. You make us proud. This club was founded in 1948 by a small group interested in the starting a yacht club on these grounds we are currently standing on. The basis of the club was to give voters, friends, families a place to get together. Bristol Yacht Club, for over the past 60 years, has met that goal with overwhelming success. Since 1948, improvements have been made on this land and water with a list too long for the time I'm allowed for a speech. On a daily basis, these rounds are filled with members and their families enjoying the access to the Delaware River. Many of our members and their kids have been raised, including my own girls, with Bristol Yacht Club being a huge part of their life. Growing up with the fundamentals and responsibilities of being on the water and with the love of Bristol members, usually referred to as uncles and aunts, leaves a lasting impression on our kids that cannot be duplicated anywhere. This club has become more to most of us than a club. It's a second home. For some of us, it may have been our first home. Although Bristol Yacht Club does not have a closing day, we do enjoy today, our opening day, to begin our season. The club has never closed, used 365 days a year by our members. Just about every day throughout the year, you will find members laughing, some arguing, but this is a family. With kids running through the grounds, even on winter days like Friday nights, members get together inside telling boating stories from the previous year and plan the upcoming season. On those nights, not only are children running around, but members also bring their dogs as well as you can probably see today. Everyone is always welcome at Bristol Yacht Club. Bristol hosts many events throughout the year. This year we were honored to host the first annual charity bonfire. Together with Edgley, Anchor, the Shamney, and Pennsylvania Yacht Clubs, we came together for a great night with friends and raising money for Christ's Home for Children in Warminster. We are looking forward to this season having our pig roast, crab feast, and full bonfire fire, I'm sorry, for all of us to enjoy a great time on the water banks of the Delaware River. At this time, I would like to call up my daughter. I'm taking advantage of this situation right now. Uh, she got flowers from mommy.